Yo, what up? What's poppin'? Back at it again with another video for y'all. Just want to chat with y'all, spread some more knowledge with y'all, some more truth, and some more motivation. And this is another video about the school system. You know, like, you know my, vi you know how I feel about the school system. The school system, it sucks. And you know, like I said, and I'll say this again, parents, Keep a check on your kids' mental health because school is not a place for a kid's mental health. All of that depression, all of that anxiety, all of those suicidal thoughts, it comes from kids, you know, just going to school. But I'm going to break down with y'all the shocking truth about, about, and now it's not all, it's not all of these teachers, but it is some. Um, because remember, like, in my other video that I did, you know, where I was explaining that some teachers don't really be reading directions carefully, and they don't really have no nerve telling students that by you not reading directions carefully, that that's a form of laziness. I'm going to break something else down with you. Some of these teachers... I mean, at the, end of the, at the end of the day, being a school teacher is a, is a regular nine to five job at the end of the day. Them school teachers are not rich. Being a school teacher is not even a, a career. That's a regular nine to five job. And some of these teachers at the end of the day are really just there to get paid. I mean, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, they, they don't really care. Some of these teachers don't really care that much about the students. All they care about is the money. Some of these teachers are not really going to put their foot down to, to take the time out to fight for the students. You know, some of these teachers are not really going to take the time out to, you know, stand up and fight for 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 equal rights for students. I mean, yeah, they did. There was a year where teachers were protesting for better teacher pay, but do 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 teachers like be protesting for for you know better ways students can like get like an understanding of a certain subject or a certain topic? Because when it comes down to a student having trouble Sometimes it has to do with the way the teacher is teaching. You know, school doesn't be do, doesn't bring the gift out of a student. It just crams all of this stuff into a student's brain and then they throw it back up on a test. You know, they throw it back up on a test and they throw it back up on a quiz or whatever. It just tries to cram all that stuff into their brain all at once. And, and, you know, like I said before, nobody, your son, your daughter, your your kids, your teenagers, they're not failures in school. Nobody's a failure in school. But the thing is, the school system is known for putting these toxic thoughts into a student's brain to make them feel that way. I mean, they shouldn't really feel that way. Every human being on this planet Earth has a gift. You know what I mean? Because, like, graduating from high school, like, all that stuff you learn when you were in high school, when you graduate, you don't even remember it. Besides, I mean, and, and, and along with that, not just you, you don't remember it, you don't even use it no more. And, and, and what, make, what makes school a waste of time is, you know, being in school for, like, 12 whole years, learning a bunch of stuff that we're not even going to use, that we're not even going to need to use. That's just a waste of time. You know, that's a waste of time. Like you put in students through all of this stress, all through all of this anxiety. And it's like, you know, what I mean, it, it, it's just it's just pointless. It's pointless. There's no need to go through all of this anxiety. I mean, school, school, school is pointless. What makes it pointless is to is being taught stuff that you're not even gonna use in your real life. I mean, you I mean you could be considered you can you can be considered a failure in school, but in real life, you you could be a straight A student. But yo, yeah, that you know that's just the shocking truth. Some of these teachers don't care about these students. At the end of the day, 
some of these teachers know the real deal. They know that it's a it's a nine to five job and they and they just there for the money. They just there for the paycheck. They don't really care much about them students. I mean, you know, I mean, they they, they I mean, when it comes down to a student not really understanding something this way or that way. Sometimes there ain't really much a teacher can really do about it. Because again, they're not a boss. They're a worker. They're a nine to five worker. They work for someone. They work for the principal. And, and the thing about it is that to be a school teacher, you do have to go to college. Like, like you going to college to become a school teacher, you going to college to become a school teacher. I mean, be, being a school teacher is a low paying job, you know, and, and just like being a janitor is a low paying job. Like janitors only get paid, you know, like it, it, it's, 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 it's a low amount, you know what I mean? It's, 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 it's not a lot of money and teachers be complaining. Teachers be, you know, talking all types of, all types of crap saying that they don't make any money. That's, that, that's one of the main reasons why you be having new teachers in, in these schools every single year. And look at the way school is now with this pandemic stuff. Like, parents and teachers are stressed out. Students are stressed out. Parents and teachers are upset that students are, like, falling behind with this and that. I mean, they can't help it. It's this pandemic stuff. This pandemic should be helping a lot of you wake up. This pandemic should be helping, helping a lot of you find out what you're really here on this earth to really do with your life. Because a lot of y'all been living a lie. A lot of y'all been doing stuff that you hated for pretty much half of your life. This pandemic should be helping you out to find out what it is that you're really here to do while you're here on this earth. Because you never really took the time out to just to just say or think that life is short. You know, what are you really here to do? I think about that all the time. What up? You know, I mean. But yeah, but that's just the shocking truth. Some of these teachers do not care anything about your kid, about your daughter. At the end of the at the end of the day, they're just there to get paid. And, you know, you, you probably don't even know that your kid, your teenager wants to be rich. They want to be successful. But it's like. At the end of the day, I mean, being in school, like if, if they if they just follow the school rules and I'm not I'm and, and again, I am not influencing. I am not recommending and I'm not encouraging nobody to drop out of high school. But 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 the but the reality of it, if, if a student really wants to become rich and they really want to become successful and they trying to do everything, they trying to like follow all of the school rules, like all of the school rules becoming a straight A student all their life or an honor roll student, uh, staying out of trouble, not getting ISS, you know, th this or that. They're trying to become a perfect student all the way through. But they're being taught by somebody that's, that's a nine to five worker, by somebody that's, I mean, really, to be honest with you, as much as these teachers be complaining, it, it seems to me, some of the you know like a lot of these school teachers are 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 broke but i mean think about it how in the world you know are is your is your son or daughter like how how are they supposed to become rich and successful and they're being taught by somebody that's a nine to five worker that, that, that that's just like somebody trying to become rich and successful and it's like they just hang out with people that are broke they hang out with people that are broke. They hang out with people that don't really have a boss mindset. They hang out with people that don't really think like a real entrepreneur. That's what it's like being a student in school that wants to be rich and successful. Your teacher doesn't think like a real entrepreneur. If they did, they 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 wouldn't be in their mid to late thirties teaching you. You know, they would be an entrepreneur by now. So, you know, it's, it's, it's just stuff that you really have to think about, you know, because, you know, this pandemic, you know, should be helping a lot of you wake up to to see what you're really here on this earth to really do with your life.
But yeah, I just wanted to share this video with y'all, spread with y'all, talk with y'all about the shocking truth, you know, about the school system, you know, more stuff, because I know I've done a bunch of videos about the school system, but this time I wanted to talk with y'all about the shocking truth. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, love y'all.